Hi, I'm Sandy Stevens with 7K Roping, and today I'd like to take a minute to tell you a little bit about what we were thinking when we started designing the little something, and tell you about some of the features that we have. So, really, basically, we wanted to just make a roller dummy that was a little more fun to roll. So, we started with giving it multiple horn options. As you can see, we've got the uh, steer horns here, but we also thought it'd be kind of cool to have the goat horn uh, option and we knew that it'd be kind of important to um, have a calf rope and dummy as well. So basically you have a three in one package here. We have the steer, the goat, and the calf. You can easily take the horns off or swap them out by removing the three simple uh, hand bolts here. You don't need any tools. Um, we also thought it would be kind of neat if you could adjust the, the horns up and down. So we made the neck adjustable. Again, it's got three simple bolts. There are grooves on the neck to make it easy uh, to find the, the nuts to insert the bolts into. This is the highest uh, head setting here and this is the lower setting right here. When we started thinking about uh, how, how to make it maybe a little more fun to rope on the feet, we, we decided we'd give it a little longer legs. Um, we decided that we'd also give it a little more clearance in the back between the legs and the roller wheels and uh, wanted to make it a little more realistic so we put the legs on the inside rather than the outside of the hips. But <clears throat> one of the really cool things that we, we did was um, we gave it caster, swivel casters and what swivel casters do is uh, they make it so that um, you can spin it faster and not have to worry about you know dragging the wheels around. You can really uh, turn it off faster and uh, not have to worry about um, dumping it over. Uh, because the caster wheels just allow it to spin very easily. But when we were thinking about the wheels, we also were thinking about what we could do to um, be able to use it not just on the concrete but also on the grass and the dirt. So we did uh, create an off-road uh, package, optional off-road package that has uh, larger, beefier uh, front swivel casters and um, larger back rollers as well. And the good thing about our off-road package here is it also works in the uh, in the little something shoot. So when we started designing the little something shoot, we wanted to make sure that it was nice and sturdy, but we wanted to make it a little more uh, portable, easier to move around, but we wanted to also make it a little more cost-effective to ship. So it comes with just a few basic components that, that come apart, but it's easy to assemble. It's you know super sturdy, comes with stainless steel hardware, so if you leave it outside, um, it's not gonna rust or anything like that. It's got rubber stoppers on the front end, so it's not moving anywhere um, when the little something is shooting out. And it's got the roller casters on the back, and to move it around, all you do is lift it up from the front end, and you can move it all around. If you wanna store it in a little more compact space, you can just lift it and uh, store it on its end to take up a little less space. The heavy duty actuator comes mounted on a uh, thick metal plate. There are magnets on the back of the chute so you can uh, leave the actuator on the chute and have somebody work it there. Or you can use it as a foot pedal. It comes with an eight foot hose so um, you, know, you can take it outside you know, pretty far if you're looking to have some fun reaching on the head side or you can have your healer uh, click the actuator for you. The speed of the little something is dependent on the pressure of the air compressor. You don't really need a very large air compressor at all. In fact, uh, at the shows and at the jackpots, we run at 60 to 70 PSI or something like that, uh, which I'm gonna show you in a second. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about the little something or the shoot for the little something, then please give us or one of our dealers a call. Thanks. Wild, wild baby, tell me where you been. Wild, wild baby, you better not have seen. Wild,